Hey, what is up guys? I'm Lachlan and I'm here with a completely new video that I've never done on this channel before. Uh, it's a Photoshop tutorial. I've been doing a lot of Photoshop recently and I just wanted to walk you through with uh, a design like this. Uh, just with the text behind, subject in front, uh, coloured with black, black and white background. Um, this is just how it works for this uh, image because the original image looks like that and with friendly and the, the word friendly it's just overexposed the overexposed areas just contrast and like just merge it all together this does not look nice so I had to do it this way um, but I've made it come out nice and I just wanted to take you uh, a step by step with how I did that so let's get right into this video so I'm going to start off let me just close the group I'm going to start off with uh, this whole this image here um, first things first is you need to uh, get your text so I have the text selected already I'll just type in the word I'm gonna use and then I'm going to click shift hold shift and drag it out um, what shift does is if you drag it sideways or straight up it moves like the same um, it just makes it bigger and doesn't like warp it so I'm just gonna make it roughly uh, the same size as before a bit bigger maybe just like that um, so we're gonna have it probably about there I reckon maybe a bit, maybe even a bit bigger so you can just chuck it here so as, as you can see it's in front just place it uh, so what we want to do is just close that and click on our background image and we want to go over to the quick select tool and if we just zoom in a bit we want to select his head neck and just like his upper body all right that's perfect and then we just want to get all the small details so we want to be perfectly in line with his beanie and then if we just make this a bit smaller i'm just going to go around here and get his hair and that looks pretty good so you're going to just click alt c if you're on uh, windows and then you want to move the layer above the text so when you click the text the text is behind him and that's that's looking real good so that's that done that's that's probably the easy part um now the second part i'm going to do is i'm just going to select his body now and then i'm going to copy and paste that again and i'm going to have that in front of the friendly uh well the text which is friendly for this and i'm going to keep that as a separate piece here so now with the background you're going to want to go up to image adjustment first you're going to want to click that and then go to image black and white to make the back one background black and white click okay so you're going to have john or your subject which is john uh, as his head, his body, and the text. Now, as I was saying earlier, the text kind of blends into the background and doesn't look too nice. So, to fix that, what I did is go to blending options, um, make sure it's selected here, go down to the friendly text, or the text of whichever is behind the subject, go down to drop shadow, so you have a drop shadow. And then just play around with this. So I'm just going to add this up to about 35. I'm going to spread it. Uh, and spread it about there, 25. Now I'm going to make the size 200. So that pretty much makes it like a, a faded outline, a super faded outline around friendly, which just brings it away from the background you can see the words friendly without having that 
black and white change it still looks black and white and then a small detail that I, I like to add is if you go to blending options double click if you double click the layer it'll go straight to blending or style and then blending um, to go to the subjects bottom half for example uh, his jumper and then go to outer glow and then just get the get a color like his collar like a, a similar a lighter color to what he's wearing that's similar to it so his color is probably perfect and then for that you're just going to want to bring the size down and have that just just a little bit about about I'm going to have about 120 122 it looks pretty good and then just just move around with the with the color or oh, for me it's the color but whichever colors now nah, I'm liking that glow there and that that's pretty much the image there um, you have your black and white background which is just here you have your layer with the glow around it as you can see here you're gonna have uh, your friendly with the black uh, shadow drop, which is just faded all the way up. Then you're gonna have your your head in front of the the friendly. And just a just a comparison, the text is slightly smaller. So if you guys want me to do more photos like this, um, I have a few ideas in mind. But if you guys want me to make some more tutorials on similar or similar um, ideas on Photoshop or more f Photoshop tutorials in general, smack a like on this uh, video. If I get 10 likes, I'll, I'll make a new uh, one probably uh, with Kevin Austin and um, River, his, his sponsor. I'll make a photo of them too. I have an idea already and possibly another one with John and Tilt um, and a few more friendly. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Um, sorry this was like super different to what I normally upload but I wanted to share this with you guys and yeah I hope you guys enjoy smack a like if you want to see another one leave a comment if you have any other ideas and yeah thanks for watching